Just start to connect first, yeah, wherever you are. And bit by bit. So first try to feel your legs, your bum touching the floor, yeah, the, the connection with your body, with the mat. And then start to bring your awareness to your breathing without changing too much. Eh? Just be aware of how you breathe at the moment. Remember, if it's difficult to connect with your breath, you can always put your hands or on your chest, or your belly, or both, one in, on the chest and the other hand on your belly, and just feel the movement of your body. And that can help you to connect more. And then bit by bit, we incorporate the visualization of receiving the energy from your breathing. So not only the oxygen, imagine that you receive energy with all the qualities that you need through your breath, but also through your whole body. It's like, like catching the energy that surrounds us. So imagine just for a couple of breaths more, that you are receiving the energy from your normal breathing through your nose. And imagine that you send the energy in when you breathe in, the energy is passing through the whole body and yourself, and then it's going down on the breathe out, deeply toward the touch of your body on the mat, and from there you can start to imagine releasing your roots as always, to the floor, to the ground, to connect with the planet. Okay? So imagine the whole journey. You breathe in. Imagine the energy is being sparse, uh, distributed in your body and in your cells, and then it's passing down to be released into the roots. And then imagine as well that you receive your breathing, your energy through the top of your head, yeah, the crown of your head. So imagine that you are opening the crown of your head, like a, a, a mouse or a nose yeah, or a channel, whatever image is nice for you. And imagine that you add also that part of your body to receive the energy. Then also imagine that you receive from like the forehead. So imagine the, the place between your eyes, yeah? the, the forehead. And, and imagine like a, a little open there. Again, a nose, a mouth, a channel, whatever you imagine. Yeah? Don't worry if you make it funny. That's, that's even better sometimes. Yeah? So we don't get too serious on the practice yeah, to attach to certain image. And just the image that is coming to you. Then obviously we have the nose. Then imagine that you are breathing also through your neck, through your throat. By the way, we are doing a little bit of chakra balancing as we do this. Yeah? So you are receiving your energy from your neck. And just to get the idea that as we open our body, you receive energy as well. Yeah? And then we go into your chest. Imagine your heart, your lungs, receiving the energy directly. And then a little bit lower on your solar plexus, you are receiving the energy as well. And 
and then a little bit lower to your belly. So imagine that you receive the energy also through the belly, but also through the back, through your lower back, through your hips. Okay? So imagine the whole area of lower back and belly, hips. The whole area is breathing, is receiving energy directly. And then imagine the sit bones also opening to receive your legs, that connection with the roots. You are activating that connection and all the roots now are more open, yeah, pumping energy from the planet into yourself. So we have the idea that we receive energy and, and oxygen from the whole of your body. And with these ideas in mind, we will put the hands on the floor. So remember that in the morning we are normally more stiff and more if we practice at home because we didn't have the all the movements that we do if we go to, to the gym or the studio. Yes. Yeah? So be patient, kind with yourself. So wherever you can relax there, try to soften, relax your neck, relax your shoulder blades, relax your hands and your elbows, even if you don't touch, yeah? just relax. Don't force. Yeah? So we always try to work with the body that we have today. Try to forget what you were able to do even yesterday, yeah? just today. You are today with your body as it is in this present moment. And then we move the hands to one side. And then to the other side. And then to the center, coming back. Well, now we put the hands behind, grounding your hips, open your chest, breathing deeply, shoulders away. And again, imagine receiving the energy from all those points, from the hips, from your lower back, belly, hips, solar plexus, chest, neck, head, throat your normal breathing through your nose, the opening from the forehead and the opening on the crown of your head. And then relax your chin to the chest. Ah, relax, release, well. Now we will bring the other leg forward. And again, so ground your hips a little bit more now. Yeah? So push into the sit bones yeah? and then put your hands and then start like a from the belly. Yeah? So relax your belly, relax your solar plexus, your chest, wherever you can, and then relax your head, your neck, soften. Let go completely. And then we move the hands to one side. And then to the other side. And then coming back to the center. We put the hands behind, grounding your hips, open your chest, breathing deeply, shoulders away, expanding. And then relax your chin to the chest. Ah, we soften, cool. So we'll move the chest in circles, 
Relaxing your hips, soften, soften shoulder blades. And as you move, remember, imagine that deep connection with the roots, sending you the energy that you need. Yeah, so you can imagine that you are receiving a healing energy to mind all the lower back, your hips, yeah, or the whole body. Or you can imagine maybe connecting with the energy of the planet, like a, in the center, that strength or resilience or the fire, and that hot energy is coming up to melt, melt and dissolve the tension that you carry. We go to the other side. Good. And then on the center. So grounding again on the seat bones. Yeah, relax your shoulders. Bring your belly a little bit in and we start to rotate to one side. Now you keep pushing with your hips. Yeah? You lengthen your spine. So it's, it's nice and strong, the pose, but not tensing on the shoulder. Yes, just a little bit of connection here on the lower belly as you rotate. And imagine you keep pushing with the hips, so you command the, the energy coming up to pass through your spine, through your hips and through your spine. And when we twist, we are trying to release the tension that we carry on the spine. And as we release the tension on the spine, the whole back gets released from pain. Yeah? So imagine that connection, that as you free yourself from the tension on the spine, that will send a signal to the muscles to release. Yeah? So lengthen, lengthen the back of the neck, try to relax your shoulders. Move the head only to the front and to the other side. And then back to the twist. Ah, relax, release, well done. And then lengthen your spine. And again, we go to the other side. So a nice connection on the belly. Not too stiff that you can breathe. It's soft at the same time. No? So connect your hips. We start to rotate. Shoulders away. Lengthen the back of the neck. And keeping the position, we bring the head only to the front and to the other side. And then back. And then relax, release, well done. 